I was just like a really strong because I always work in a farm, in the farm with my family. And I like so I was not really technical in soccer or in basketball or whatever another sport. So then when I started fighting, I had some advantage because like I was stronger than other kids. So I was like 14 years old and like I'm like strong like a man already. And uh, that like it gave me some uh, some advantage and I started to win things like. Uh, First tournament. My first tournament was like two weeks after I started, I win like in my first tournament. And I said, damn, I'm good on the thing. And, uh, and it keep like that, so I win a lot of stuff in the Jiu-Jitsu and I think it, that's motivated me to keep it going. I was like a training Jiu-Jitsu, I, I was like a purple belt in 2006. I keep training a lot, but first Jiu-Jitsu. And then the guy like looked at me and said, hey, we are in the MMA show. And uh, that happened. The guy looks, hey, someone like it don't show up. I say, what? The guy say, you wanna fight? I say, yeah, that's fine. Put gloves on, it was my first time. I even, I, 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 can't, I remember, I even like wrap my hands or nothing. Just put the gloves on. The guy sell the gloves and all right, let's go. I remember like, I don't punch the guy. It was like a three to four punches in the air and a double leg and finish him an arm bar. Like a first minute in the fight. And uh, that's was like you know, how it starts. And then I say, wow. In that fight, I don't get paid, just for <laughs> clarify. But after they say, you hey, can't get paid for that. You know that? I say, oh, it's not something to think. But then I start like a tournaments and the whole thing. And then I just quit jobs. <laughs> and then start to fight, pretty much. I'm in the first one in the family, I speak another language, and uh, get, off, get out of the country. So. For me, it's like a more than because for them, like a, especially in the beginning, they like a, not my mother because she always was in my side, but the rest of the family, you know, like a, her brothers, her, my grandma, everybody around, they always say, "Man, what you doing? Why don't fuck, I don't find a job or something like that?" I say, "That's my job," and then they say, "No way, go study, blah blah blah," and they're like, "It's all right, you know, I go study, I go to the college, I get my degree, I did everything they say." But I keep it that fighting thing like it right there and like the little fire always. And they say like man, you should like go work with your degree or whatever. And they end up like the jiu-jitsu bring me out of the country. The jiu-jitsu give me this chance to be what I want. And, I, and that's what I want. I want to be a fighter. Even the teacher thing is like a kind of like a it's something like it happened in the in the middle of the thing because I, I was trying to be a fighter. And uh, I don't know, I think like it's just for me, it's like for a proof I can do, you know, and, and, and uh, it's not like a proving for them, it's just like for proof for myself because I always have that thing like you can't, you can't, you can't, because you come from the farm, you're supposed to like live and die in the farm there, and uh, look where I am, you know, I'm pretty much like, a, I'm happy where I am already, I, I think like a, I reached something like a really big for someone like coming from where I am. And, uh, right now it's like everything I get now is a compliment. Everything. So if I get the UFC, nice. If not, I'll be happy either.